Astronomers have detected a kilonova, which is the collision of two dead stars at nearly light speed. That collision produced invisible gravitational waves that were detected by LIGO. And what's significant is that this is the first time gravitational waves have been corroborated by a collection of Earth and space-based observatories and telescopes. The NSF-funded LIGO laboratory is a set of two instruments designed to detect gravitational waves from the universe. One of the grand challenges identified by the astronomy and particle communities and therefore funded by the NSF is multi-messenger astronomy. And that fits into our larger picture here via multiple instruments needing to bring their data to the compute engine and analyzing it and reconstructing it and so forth. And one of the more inter most interesting uh, recent examples is when um, gravitational waves get correlated to neutrinos, get correlated to electromagnetic waves, and a coherent picture emerges for the science. Comet is a watershed moment for us because it's the first fully integrated high-performance computing system that we've ever had. For hundreds of years, all you needed to do research was a library. Now, in most disciplines, it is unthinkable to do research without research computing.